equestrian people? Seriously. <laughs> what the fuck is that bus train doing up there? <laughs> Seriously. <laughs> Anyways, I am not trans. Some of you straight people usually get that confused with drag queens, unfortunately. My roommate's 13-year-old son actually just moved here from Ontario because his father is an alcoholic and he's in prison. <laughs> if she was here tonight, she'd kill me for saying that, but this is true. Anyways, he asked me yeah, how come I do drag, and I simply told him that uh, when you're gay, you can't sing, and you're too overweight to be in the entertainment business, you lip sing to other people's songs, kind of like with straight people. When they want to make money and they, can't, they have no talent, they rap. <laughs> <laughs> no talent at all. So, who, uh, yeah, so where's my gays at? Oh, fuck, where the fuck are my gays at? <laughs> They're like my demographic. The straight people were like, sleeping. It's fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> my first time up here, it's, it's great, you know. Oh, fuck. <laughs> have you straight people, like, do you guys have any gay friends? <laughs> <laughs> they release people to help you pick out what you're going to wear. Kind of like unbutton that a little bit. <laughs> Show off your skin a little bit. Are you with her tonight or with him? <laughs> you're by yourself. Oh. Aww. Okay, well, we don't care about you anymore. <laughs>
their baby photos in a photo, in a photo album. Instead of like, oh, you saw that on Facebook. It's like, you're a fucking idiot. <laughs> like, don't post your fucking kids' photos on fucking Facebook. Fucking 16-year-old mothers. I mean, don't pity them for getting pregnant. It's self-inflicted. No. Okay? Tonight, I'm going to get really fucking drunk, and I'm going to take my freaking Tylenol the next day to cure my hangover. They just never took their fucking after pill, morning after pill. So, anyway, it's looking like it might be up. <laughs> Yay, my first time. Hooray. Yeah, I can't sing for shit. Uh, like Mark Day, actually. He's on right. <laughs> He killed Canadian Idol. And, uh, actually, funny story before I go with Mark Day. Me and him used to work at the Delta together. He, uh, he was a bellman, and I was, uh, I was keeping. <laughs> and, uh, I had to clean up, uh, I think it was like a George Street Festival. I cleaned up a lot of shitty rooms. Like, you guys know George Street Festival. We straight people. Go, 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 go. rooms, like, Depends diapers, and, yeah, you guys are fucked up. And, uh, so anyways, there it was, like, sanitizing my hands, and I have, like, sold panties, like, on my car. Mark Day comes out making fucking $20 from singing to his friggin' customers because they know who the fuck he is. <laughs> fuck you, Mark Day. <laughs> the only tips I got was, like, when people leave the rooms and they have, like, half beer left over. <laughs> I still drank it, but fuck you, Mark Day. <laughs> Right? No. What's your first name, girl? Chris. <laughs> <laughs>